So now I'll go back to my checklist. Okay. I did the taxi, so our transponder's on, my headset is on, I did the radio call, I set the altimeter, I taxied with the stick, I did the brake test, oil temperature is good, fuel selector, that's here. So I look at my fuel tanks and it says I'm supposed to put it on the fullest tank. Now well, they're both the same, so I can leave it where it is. Okay, so I step on the brakes. Now I have to have at least 4,800 RPM. So I have 48, 4,900. Right. So I'm ready to go. Are you ready? I'm ready. Here we go. Oh, this is so cool. So I'm looking at just down the runway to keep it straight. I'm checking to see my speed, looking down the runway, checking my speed. The airplane wants to fly, so we'll let her fly. And there we are. Oh, this is very cool. So now, how did you, you were just going back and forth between your feet to well, On my feet just to straight? keep it straight, yeah. Just gentle pressure using the rudder, the aerodynamics. And you really can't see over this. You're really looking up into the sky. At That's this right. At this point, the nose is, is high up. And actually, this is a shallow climb. Uh, to be more efficient, I could actually raise it higher. And I check my speed, OK? Uh -huh. And the best climb speed is about 65. OK. So to go uh, slower, I raise the nose higher. To go faster, I put the nose down. Oh, this is very cool. I'm going to turn off my fuel pump and my landing light. I don't need them anymore. So you only need those on when you're landing yes. or taking off? Exactly. Okay. The landing light is on basically during the day so that other people can see you clearly. And the fuel pump is used as just a backup in case the mechanical fuel pump in the engine would fail during takeoff. Okay. So where are we? We are off the end of the runway. Um, just about ready to cross over the northeast extension. Oh, that's what this is, okay. So I'm going to turn in your direction. Quaker Town Traffic Corp upstairs departing to the south today. So as I make the turn, I'm looking to see what my speed is. I'm looking outside, making sure that everything looks clear. This is your speed? That's my speed. Okay. And this is my altitude. Okay. If you look out just at the end of the wing out there, you can see the airport. Oh, right. So now I'm just getting close to 2,500 feet. That's Quaker Town down there. Okay. Okay. So I pulled the throttle back a little bit so that she's not working quite so hard. And it seems to be trimmed pretty well. So I'm at 2,340 feet going down just a little bit and at 96 knots. And what is 96 knots? That's our, my speedometer. Okay. Okay. Which is equivalent to? Uh, how fast you would go. So, like, I mean, in a car, how fast is that? It's not the same. No, so it's more probably like 100 and some miles an hour. Okay. Like that. Okay, so put your left hand on the stick. Okay. Okay. See how I hold it just kind of with two fingers? Okay. Okay, and put your right hand on the throttle. Okay. Okay, and I'm going to say it's your airplane. And when I do, I'm going to take my hands off and I'm going to put them in the air so that you know that you have the airplane. And what am I going to do? Well, you're going to fly straight and level here for a little bit. How but do my I? Point is, well, okay. My point is, when I say it's my airplane, I'm going to want to see the same thing. Hand come off the stick, hand come off the throttle, and go in the air like this. Okay. Okay. So it's your airplane. And so what do I do? So push forward a little bit on the stick because you're climbing and look outside. See the horizon out there? Yep. See its relationship to the glare shield? Yep. Okay. So you are in just a little bit of a descent. Okay. So just, I want to come so up. So you're looking, no, actually you're looking no? really good. Okay. Well, I seem to be going the wrong way. Oh, well, that's okay. We're doing whatever we want, actually. I'll show you a trick, though. Okay. So as uh, pilots, we often get into this situation. We got off of our road. Right. So in order to correct the road, there's a direct to. I want to go from where I am directly to my point. Okay. So 
and it says, are you sure you want to do that? Yes. Are you really sure? Yes. So it changes my line. So it brings oh. the line from me <laughs> to the airplane. <laughs> oh, that's nice. 790 You're doing this I'm doing right? this Yeah, now, yes. okay, good. It's my airplane, yeah. Okay. So, so I got us off, way off track. Yeah, well. But that's okay. For the first time, you have done spectacular. Well, great. That's good. Thank you. Which is 1,000 feet above the runway elevation. Okay. okay. So the runway was at like 590? 530. 530. Very good. Okay. So that means we want to be at about 1530. Okay. And, and for government work, we'll say 1,500 feet is close enough. Okay. Okay. So I'm going to turn the autopilot off. Okay. okay. Sally's going to tell us that we did that. And then I'm going to turn to the right because I'm too close to the airport and come back around. So okay. you're going to see us make a, a descending turn all the way around. Autopilot. Disconnect. Thank you, Sally. So, so this is autopilot and that is autopilot. This is the disconnect button and that's oh, the that's engage the, button. Okay, got it. So I pulled the throttle all the way back to idle. Okay. So we're starting to descend. Yep. As I said, I'm turning in my direction. Yeah. And I'm going down to 1,500 feet. Okay. So the other thing I'm doing is my landing checklist, and I kind of have that memorized, and it's really easy anyway. You'll pump on, landing light on. Okay. Our seat belts are on and attached. My instruments are set up. There's 2,000 feet. And you just gave it less A little bit of throttle. A little bit, I thought so. To I slow heard down it. my descent. Good, that's okay. very good. I heard it. And if you look out my right window, uh -huh. there's the airport. Oh, yeah, right yeah, there. okay. And you're going to want to land in the direction that we're of going. The wind. That's right. So you sometimes you might go around this way and come in. Absolutely right. Or Depends if the winds yeah. are from the east okay. or from the west. Water Valley traffic, Piper Sport, November 674, Pops Airs on the 45, or on the way 29 are quick down. Okay, so we're at 1500 almost. Right. So I'm at pattern altitude. I don't want to descend anymore right now. So now I'm turning on to the downwind leg. Quaker Town traffic, flight for Sport, November 674, Pop Sierra's downwind, runway 29er, Quaker Town. So I'm looking to see the relationship of the runway to the airplane. A little low, so I'm making a correction. Make sure there's no other planes. Good girl. We don't want any surprises. Oh, that's right. Okay, at this point, I look over at the runway and see where the airplane is. That looks about right. So now I make my transition to start my descent into Quaker Town. So I have to be below a certain speed or I'll damage the flaps. Okay. So I bring the throttle back. I'm looking for 75. Right, you're there. So now the flaps come down. And now I'm turning onto the base leg. Quaker Town traffic, flight for Sport, November 674, Pop Sierra, base, runway 29er, Quaker Town. So I have full flaps. Okay. Now I'm re-trimming so that Sally can fly herself, so I'm pushing the button for the trim tab. That looks pretty good. Speed looks pretty good. Making sure that we don't have any surprises. So now what I'm doing is using my judgment so that I am approaching the runway at the angle that I'm used to. Okay. I control my rate of descent with the throttle. Uh-huh. And I control the speed of the airplane with the nose attitude. 500. Thank you, Sally. So She's the just giving me a... going to go this way, correct? It goes this way yeah. to, to slow my rate of descent. Okay. Okay. And the nose comes up to slow my airspeed. So right now, my airspeed is good. I like 55. Okay. But I'm coming down a little bit too quickly, so I added just a little bit of throttle. Okay. So 
right now the winds are coming from the right to the left. Yep. So I'm correcting by angling the airplane a little bit into the wind. So I'm looking at two nine there. That's where I want to land. Okay. So now I start looking down the end of the runway. Uh-huh. Just hold the airplane off, hold it, hold it there. You can... Do you remember the year that's past? You're putting the brakes on slowly. Yeah. Okay. And I missed my turn off a little bit. Oh, right. But that's okay. Breaker down traffic. We're about to back to two nine real quick. did good. Thank you. That was fun. Ah, that's the magic word. That was really that's fun. That's why I do this. If we're not having fun, we're doing something that wrong. That was really fun. Good. I'm glad to hear that. Blessings the whole year through. Could have stayed up for. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> good. I'm going to hear. 